Okay, so um, I have gotten started on the uh, on the Guardian farm, and I, I'm, I'm kind of stuck and don't know what I'm going to do at this point. Now, I know I was going to, uh, to time-lapse the process of, um, of getting the Guardian farm started, but uh, I forgot to click record. So what we've got is I've just thrown a whole bunch of soul sand all over the top of the monument, which is just like right here. So you can see here as we go around that um, that we've got all of this soul sand keeping the uh, keeping the whole place popping everything around. And um, oh, damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! I get hit again. I can see it already. Yeah. Okay. So, um, what I've been doing is I've been brewing a lot of potions, and uh, I think I need to brew more potions. Um, actually, did I have more potions with me? I do have more potions with me. Uh, what I don't have is space in my inventory to, uh, carry those potions around so uh yeah uh so i've been using uh, invisibility night vision and water breathing to get around and uh and do all of this work and uh it has it has been of mixed utility because as, as i believe i mentioned i uh i don't know what i'm doing so <laughs> it's let me drop the water bottles back in here, and um, you have to keep your uh, you have to keep your armor off if you want the um, if you want the guardians not to mess with you. So all of my armor is sitting in here in the ender chest, and uh, and what I'm thinking is uh, I need to build a kind of um, I need to build a frame around this area. In order to do that, what I want to do is, um, okay, I, damn it. It's far enough away now that I can't hit him. Would have been cool if I could have hit that guy over there. But uh, yeah, we've... Um... Okay, so what I need to do is um, I need to swim out there and I need to place a lily pad and then that lily pad I need to build off of and I need to use a bunch of blocks and I don't know what blocks I'm going to use. I need to... Uh... Let me go grab a bunch. So, um, yeah, I will probably uh, will probably grab deep slate bricks and uh, and use those because that's what I always use because I'm I'm boring and stupid. So yeah, let's go back and uh, grab a whole bunch of how much do I need? One, two. Well, I'm going two chunks, so yeah, one, two, to go around once, a little more than two. It's going to take a little more than two stacks to go around once, and I'm going to need to go around one, two, three, four times, I think. Um, well, do I need to go around four times? No, one of them is going to be, uh, one of them is going to be scaffolding. Um, in fact, okay, 
Um, I do need to get a bunch of blocks, and I do need to mess around with this, and I also need to um, need to be ready to prep a new round of potions. So yeah, I'll um, okay. Have I got what I need for a new round of potions? I do. I have what I need for two more rounds of potions. I think maybe even three. So, all right, I'm going to come on up here and I placed a whole bunch of chests all over the place. I redid my, uh, my residential area. If you come over here, you see that the former bedroom is now bare. And if you then come upstairs far enough. If you come up to the beetroot level, come up past the melons, and then past the wheat, and up to the beetroot, we've got chests. We've got so goddamn many chests. And over here we have a bunch of deep slate. So I'm going to grab eight stacks of deep slate. And that's where I'm going to start on this. Okay. Eight stacks of deep slate should be enough. I've got a bunch of scaffolding sitting inside the, uh, sitting inside there, and okay. And if this works out, I will go and make more scaffolding once I've, uh, once I've finished this. Um, I have got a vague sort of notion that uh, that I'm going to do this a particular way. And it's going to be a mess because things aren't spaced out properly, so I'm going to have to move things around if, uh, if this actually works. But uh, that's doable. That's not an issue. Um, so I should go ahead and start moving stuff around because it's, I'm definitely going to need Yep. Yeah, I should move stuff around. I'm gonna need to move the entire soul sand area out by one more block. In fact, I'm gonna need to move it out by two more blocks. So, okay. Moving out by two blocks, I'm going to need to We start with the potion of night vision, so when the night vision wears off, everything else is about to wear off, so when your vision starts popping off, then, uh, then you know you've got a problem. So we're gonna begin out here, and we're gonna take I'm going to take two blocks. start swimming. Oh, 
Okay, so there's that side. Now we're gonna come around here. And we're invisible, so they're not fucking with me. And we're gonna take out... that over and now we come around the side and we go we're gonna plant a two wide course here sense of deja vu as I'm doing this and I don't know why I have never built a guardian farm before so I don't know why I would have deja vu building one and I'm out of soul sand Which obviously shouldn't happen because... Into this one because this is only five wide and we need it to be seven. soul sand again. So that's a race over here. How are we doing on uh, everything? Only a few minutes left. I'm going to have to uh, grab some soul sand. Yeah, this is what you missed a whole bunch of while I was uh, forgetting to record. Okay, and that'll do it on this side.
Kind of pop around collecting shit. Now this bit over here should uh Two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. This is still fourteen across. And, um, okay. I actually fucked up on that. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to get a uh, I want to get a channel four wide down the middle of that. So um, yeah. Okay. Regardless, I um, I need to go make new potions. And we get new. And we'll get new water bottles, and, uh, and then we'll go make new potions. And I think I have everything I need to do there. I'm going to need two golden carrots and a blowfish. And I have got a blowfish. powder if I need it, and I might. So you never work, which I'm growing. That's not a problem. I need golden carrots, which I've laid in a supply, and I need I need blowfish. I think I collected a couple of those. So my organization is still pretty much the same. I still do the animal, vegetable, mineral thing. So the first thing we need is puffer fish, blowfish, fugu. on up there and collect some so we should have blowfish right in there yeah we do there's one one blowfish and I'm gonna need one fermented spider eye. So I need a brown mushroom and I need a spider eye and I need a single bit of sugar cane. I got some sugar cane somewhere. I should have sugar. There's some sugar cane. All right, there's some sugar cane. And now I need two golden carrots. There we go. And finally, I need another work. One, two, three. I come over here and we go blip and we. 
chuck our three water bottles in there and we chuck in some nether wart. All right. And I will blow my nose while I'm waiting. Okay. And our potions are ready. So we'll run on over to them and go, hey, we want these to be night vision potions, which I will proceed to turn into invisibility potions once they're done. And then I will need some redstone. To turn these potions into eight minute potions. All right. Step one complete. We have got three eight minute invisibility potions. Um, I appear to be missing a bottle of water. That's confusing. Where could it have gone? This is weird. Um, okay, regardless. Up the nether word in there. <laughs> Drop the golden carrot in there. And then drop the redstone in there. I'm going to need more blaze powder. We all done there? We are all done there. Okay. Redstone dust. More blaze powder. What did happen to my, uh, my third water bottle. Visibility, invisibility, night vision, night vision, night vision. Where's my last water bottle? This is driving me nuts. I'm gonna go ahead and make more bottles. So I can... <laughs> this is ridiculous. Okay, and you see here we've got this handy guide that tells you like all of the various different potion effects and how to get them. Uh, here's strength and here's protection and here's regeneration, water breathing, slow falling, uh, turtle potions, 
I never make turtle potions. And then you have the uh, the reversible potions. You've got the uh, the spider eye, which makes it uh, the spider eye gives you poison, and the uh, rabbit sweat gives you leaping, and the sugar gives you speed. You can reverse both of those for slow, and the glistering melon will increase your health, and the spider eye will uh, will cut, make it into a harm potion. You got night vision, invisibility, and then you've got uh, weakness from just the pure fermented spider eye. These are water breathing three minutes, so redstone dust will make them into water breathing eight minutes. And there we have it. So there's the water breathing, water breathing, water breathing. And I will come over here and uh, show water breathing, water breathing. And now we can head back because we've got our, uh, we've got our appropriate potions. Night vision up front, so we uh, so we do things in the right order. Okay, so we're gonna head upstairs. We're gonna take the drop shaft. <laughs> I'm busily extending the castle, although I have no idea what to do with the extension. You can see over here that I've extended that floor out over here and we've kind of stepped out this part of the wall a bit there and we've stepped it out a bit up front too, you can see up here, and a bit to the side. So all of that is where it needs to be. and. Okay, so we're gonna head over here. We're gonna head on in, and I need to pull. What do I need to pull? Um, I need to pull a little strip of four blocks out of the middle. Yeah, I just need to scoot that four blocks along. So... We'll begin out at the far edge, then. Which means I am going to need... I'm going to need two stacks of soul sand to do that. And I should probably bring four. Well, I don't have four to bring. Okay. So.
That's okay. You can sit in there. Is there this? Yeah, I don't want to make y'all watch this, but... Okay, I think that is that, and... Then I need to... Kind of three minutes on these, so I do want to go through and collect all of this.
So I wanna, what I want to do now is I think I want to start by taking out those four, which means you're going to come over here. You got to count over. We got to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think right there. No, yeah. A minute left. So we'll refresh that. Oh, that's fucking, that's Dolphin's Grace. It's because a dolphin's nearby. At least I think it is. Okay, and now we extend this. This should now come four blocks this way, and that should leave a two block gap. God damn it, what the hell? So we want a two block gap there, which like, this isn't right, is it? Is it? Oh, okay. We definitely want this to be
Okay. So we've got our four block gap there. And now we need our two block gap here. So if I drop down here, first thing we need to do is uh, take off these extras here. Should be like right at the edge of the chunk. Okay, and this should be one, two, three, four, five, six. No, this is seven. If that's seven, then yeah, I need to. Uh, okay. How am I doing? Uh, okay, I've got enough. This is fine. these are at and so I'm just placing them in the easiest place for them to be placed okay and now we pull the uh, what are we doing here okay and we pull these uh, Okay, so that should now be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then a gap of two, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then a gap of four, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, gap of two, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and that's exactly what we need. So now let's come back up top. And let's scoot back over here. Okay, and there we have the uh, we have the initial setup. And I need to figure out the hell I am doing at this point because um, I'm not really clear on how it is I'm going to put this together. So uh, I need to figure that out. Uh, let me think for a moment. I have to sneeze.
Amazingly, I did not forget to turn my microphone back on. It was just sneezing and blowing my nose that whole goddamn time. Okay, so... I need to figure out what exactly... There's my other water bottle. I, I knew it was going to be something like that. Okay, so... Okay. I want the invisibility to actually be the last thing I take. So it's night vision, water breathing, invisibility. Okay. Now, um... I don't seem to have any, um... I don't have a boat with me. How do I get... I'm an idiot. I was putting everything away, and I put my boat in one of the chests. All of my effects have worn off. Let me turn off the... Let me turn off the chunk borders there, and, um... Scooch back over to the, uh... Back to the lab, and uh, we will grab we'll grab a boat. And um, and then we'll head back and we'll start putting together the um, I think I want to go two blocks below water level. And just kind of ring the area. Okay. Um, so you got this platform that's right at water level. And this platform right at water level is going to be the same level that the scaffolding is. So the scaffolding will sit right inside the water and be waterlogged. And the momentum of being pushed up by the bubble column should, uh, should keep it sitting out there. And... Okay, um, what am I doing all the way up here? I don't need to be all the way up here. I need to be down on the beetroot level. And I need to come over here and grab a boat, and I'm pretty sure I've got several floating around in these chests. Yeah, here's a birch boat. Birch is good. We can use birch. And it's getting dark, but I will sleep in the bed when I get over to the Ocean Monument so I can keep my spawn location right next to it. You can see from my levels that I uh, died a couple of times putting this shit together. All those iron golems over there. Just hanging around. I 
I'm actually pretty impressed at how well my machine is handling all these fucking water columns. It's so hot, I goddamn particles. we go to the ocean monument we're gonna step through the portal and we're gonna jump in the bed and we're gonna jump in the boat and uh, let's turn on the chunk borders and let's see what happens if I uh, take the boat over bubble columns it may not go very well. God damn it. Okay. So, yeah. Um, God damn it. I'm going to die again. Yeah, I'm going to have to, uh, I'm going to have to go make new potions. It's a good thing I have the full supplies right here. Well, very nearly the full supplies. Okay, new suite of potions. This is bullshit. I fucking hate this shit. It's just so goddamn obnoxious. Okay, I gotta go make new potions. And... And I gotta go collect all of my shit. This is, this is not a huge problem. But uh, clearly I am going to have to do most of this work in the next um, in the next installment. These potions are really the key to being able to get this done. I couldn't do it if I didn't have these potions. Unless I went into, like, creative mode or some such shit, but that's fucking cheating.
Okay, so pufferfish. Um Pufferfish. Brown mushroom. Bread of sugar cane. Spider eye. Pretty sure the fermented spider eye is shapeless, and it is. Now I need two golden carrots. And I need three nether wart. Oh, and three redstone. There we go. We will jump on in here and go water, water, water. Another word. Now we'll go ahead and brew all of our awkwards to start off with. So we'll do our nine awkwards and then we'll do our uh, our six night visions and our three water breathing. I wonder if it matters what order you do them in. So now we'll do the night vision potions. And then we'll go ahead and throw the spider eye up there. And get our invisibility potions. And finally, we do the pufferfish, and then we go to uh, making everything a redstoney potion. Okay. There's the puffer fish. And then we redstone them. Okay, so we're going to start with invisibility. I'm going to go to the night vision potions, and finally we'll go to the water breathing potions, and everything will be sitting in the proper layers in my inventory. And then we'll head over and collect the shit from my grave. Water breathing three goes up there, and that's the final set of potions. And 
and there we have it. New set of potions. Uh, I am now out of blowfish, so uh, that's going to be an issue. Up to the drop shaft. all the way to the um, to the appropriate part of the, no wait no we don't because uh, yeah we uh, we took the mine carts back so yeah we can still take the mine carts awesome I have been thinking about the uh, the future direction of the series and in March, I am going to create a brand new world and we're going to start this shit over. I'm going to finish up the to-do list, which means the uh, the Guardian farm that we're working on now, then the Wither Skeleton farm, the Wither, the beacons, and the grabbing all of the netherite shit. And um, once I've got that taken care of, everything's basically going to be some minor cleanup and just fucking around doing various crap. And, uh, and in March, I'm gonna start a brand new world on the first, and we're gonna be changing a bunch of the, uh, I'm gonna dump a lot of these mods that I'm using because they're not all that helpful and they just kind of confuse the issue. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna dump many of the mods and uh, we may be changing up some of the house rules too I'm still thinking about that um, anyway that's where things are at the moment these where they belong. Go sneeze. And, uh, and then proceed to reorganize these. And let's go grab our shit. You can't see me. None of you can see me. Okay, so where? Where is my grave? Here on top of a bubble column, that's like a possibility. Um, should be in this general vicinity, like right here. Crap. Eight eighty five forty three seven fifty seven. There it is. Moon. And we'll go on back up here and jump in the boat and all of our uh,
So here we've got. Uh, what we want is for. Um, what we want is for the top layer of scaffolding to sit on top of this. So. I'm going to come out here in this direction. I want to come out right to the chunk border right here. And that's the uh, that's the limit there. And um, let's grab the boat back, and we'll go boom, boom. There we go. That leaves us another 63 here. We've got uh, four minutes left on our potions, so... There we go, and we're going to have 30 more off in the other direction. Okay, and that should be edge of the chalk. And it is. Okay. Have I got more? No, I have not. Okay. So at this point, we need another, uh, yeah, we need another stack of, we need another stack of deep slate. Off to the side here. And jump off and we can come over here where we can grab ourselves some more deep slate and head back out. What are we doing? We got two minutes. Okay. I don't need this fucking kelp.
gonna do another layer right here. here so and we want to take our scaffolding and this should waterlog the scaffolding which it does Okay, so, having done that, we should now be able to Ooh, that's all the farther up they go is the uh That's an issue. Okay, I'm gonna have to figure out a slightly different process on this. Not entirely sure what it's gonna be. What I was expecting was that I would start from here and and I would be able to go seven blocks out, but apparently not. Okay, so I need to figure out how I'm gonna do that. Um, they do jump up on here and just kind of flop around. Um, okay, what if I start with a lily pad, then Drop down underneath that lily pad over here and place a brick, then place another brick, and now I can place another scaffolding. Okay. So what I want to do is figure out a way that I can go. How far can I go this way? Well, I can definitely go Okay, so I think, I think that's a doable process. I'm doing on things, you got four minutes, okay. I need more scaffolding. I do not need the soul sand at the moment. Okay. So, this is not going to be easy.
Okay. Um. him out of my boat um i need to figure out how to um this is a mess this is um this is not going to be fun at all <laughs> okay um need to okay so we got the one there we got one two three one two three and then we got one one two three and then one two Okay, that's one too many. That's one too far out. Okay, so now if I come over here and I pull except that last one. No, that's the wrong one. Oh, God damn it, God damn it, God damn it. God damn it. Reorganize all of my shit. There we go. So, what we've got here is we've gone out uh, six, seven, that's eight. That's not where that should be. That should be...
Okay, so... This, I think, is the... Uh, this is probably the correct setup. So we go... Um, potions we doing okay Okay. So that should give us Okay. And at this point should be able to Send that out again. Three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hmm. I'll try it.
Okay, yeah, we've uh, we've gone a bit too far on this, I think. What is the issue here? Okay, we're about to be fucked if we don't get the hell out of here. And there's a drowned with a trident. Okay. Alrighty. Now, uh... Move that stuff around. Night vision, invisibility, water breathing. This is our last round. Before we have to, um, yeah. We are getting a bunch of guardian spawns. We're getting guardian spawns. The guardians are popping up and they're flopping around all over the place. Um, not really happy with the way this is working. Was invisible. That's so fucked up. and get my goddamn boat back. <sighs> this is bullshit. <laughs> I gotta go make more potions. I don't even have all my potion bottles and shit back yet. Can I make more potion bottles too? Fuck. Oh, God damn it! I'm out of puffer fish. Fuck, I'm an hour and a half in too. Yeah, we gotta, we got we're gonna have to get back to this next, uh, we're gonna have to get back to this next episode. Oh, God damn it! Oh, shit. Okay, I've made it, I've made it, everything's gonna be cool, we're gonna make it back to the base. I'm gonna be able to make new potions. And... <sighs> well, I gotta find more puffer fish, though. Well, I, I don't actually need to quote unquote find more puffer fish. I can just go fishing. So I've never been fishing on stream. So yeah, I'm uh. I'm gonna go to. I just lost like eight minutes of potion effect because those fucking guardians were already targeting me when I went invisible. That's bullshit. Alrighty. So let's go and grab, you know what? I'm going to enchant. An incredible fishing rod. That's what I'm gonna do, but uh, I will have to do that next episode. In the next episode, we shall create an amazing fishing rod and we shall go fishing for puffer fish. We'll grab ourselves some Peter Puffers, and, uh, and that will be the thing that we do next time, which is like immediately for me, but you know. Not for you, you're going to be waiting a couple hours.